take our lead, let's help you make your mark. Our goal is your satisfaction. Let us show you the way. The Phillips curve has broken down for many of the same reasons the U.S. economy has seen a dramatic increase in income inequality. Workers simply don't have the bargaining power to translate increased demand for their labor into higher wages. Let's help you make your mark. What the Phillips Curve Model Illustrates The Phillips Curve illustrates that there is an inverse relationship between unemployment and inflation in the short run, but not the long run. The long-run Phillips Curve is vertical at the natural rate of unemployment. Take our lead! Stagflation in the 1970s, many countries experienced high levels of both inflation and unemployment also known as stagflation. Theories based on the Phillips curve suggested that this could not happen, and the curve came under a concerted attack from a group of economists headed by Milton Friedman. Make your mark, take our lead. The Phillips curve depicts the relationship between unemployment and inflation. Therefore, we can say that in the long run, the Phillips curve will be vertical because irrespective of the price level, unemployment will return to its natural rate, natural rate of unemployment aka NRU. Take our lead. The main criticism of the Phillips curve is that the negative relationship between unemployment and inflation is the short-run phenomenon. In the long run, such a trade-off disappears, a situation where the unemployment rate moves towards the equilibrium, leading to the Nairu, Friedman 1968, Phelps 1968. Make your mark, take our lead. A decrease in energy prices, a positive supply shock, would cause the AS curve to shift out to the right, yielding more real GDP at a lower price level. This would shift the Phillips curve down toward the origin, meaning the economy would experience lower unemployment and a lower rate of inflation. Take our lead. The linear and nonlinear slopes are both close to zero, consistent with the common view that the Phillips curve is flattening. However, the wage Phillips curve is much more resilient and is still quite evident in this time period. Take our lead. The Phillips curve prescribes a negative trade-off between inflation and unemployment. Phillips curve forecasts appear to be more accurate when the economy is weak and less accurate when the economy is strong, but any improvement in the forecasts vanished over the post-1984 period. Take our lead. The Phillips curve predicts that when the unemployment rate drops, inflation will rise as businesses compete for scarce labor and drive up wages. The researchers studied U.S. wage and price inflation at the federal and city level, using data reaching as far back as the 1950s. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe and hit the bell notification.